Ah, he's restrained himself. Turns it away, leg side, gets a single, so he's decided that he needs more time before he can launch. There again. And Shahid Afridi is making sure that he gets a bat in. The forward defence. Fielding as well. Gets another single, so he wants to stay out there, he wants to bat long, he's already played. McLennigan or a Freedy here. Well, he beats the bat. Yet, pace off the pitch. We're talking about energy and pace and the weather, let's have a word with Fakhri Alam. Whoa, <laughs> it is cold out here. I'm on boundary side, and I'll tell you what, it is drizzling. It's rain coming down, and I don't know who is going to take advantage of this weather. But whoever it is, let's go back to the bombs. Well, advantage or not, a Freedy just dropped this out of the ground. Pace on. It's pace on. 233 HPL tournament sixes. And Mitch McLennigan is the man on the receiving end. And how easy did he make this look? Just a little bunt. And the man in the leather jacket, the Fonz out there, put it down. He's going to blame the weather. A free D goes leg side again. Is this gone the distance? Yes, it has. Well, I called it before the over. I called it before he bowled a ball. I didn't understand why you'd put pace back on the ball given how well the spinners had gone for Imad Wazim and the Kings. Shade Afridi is just biding his time, he's just waiting until he got something delicious to tuck into. And now it's uh, the Kings captain with one or two things to think about. I love Full deliveries, 172, not too bad with the short either, but right now, McLanagan, well, is it spinning? Where does he go next? Goes short, gets pulled, but straight to the man, just a single. Pace on the ball, and the free the... Well, lucky to get away with that. Scampering back for two. That could have gone anywhere. Pepsi catch a crow. Oh, you've got to catch that. That's a gimme. Oh, please. No, kick him out. Dangerous thing. Wear a helmet, please, someone. Pars just having a chat here. Oh, yes, to tape off the bowling fingers. I'm sorry. Yes, do as you're told. Does bowling hand or not? Well, it's bowling hand, but it's it's his two fingers that don't get on the ball. Is is that something that's driven by the the batsman, or is that the umpires? Yeah, good question. I think more so the umps. Hello. And, oh, nearly, nearly a screamer. HBL Maximums clock over another one. It's the six counter, two, three, five so far this season. Well, this ball really did stop and sit up in the pitch. And I just wonder whether this was a catching opportunity. Just over his head, but look how far in off the line he is there. This stage of the innings, when you, you un started to come alive a little bit more. Last one of the 16th, and Boom Boom's on strike. And well watched and negotiated. Did go off the street, in fact. Yeah, just a subtle change there. Up against a Freedy. So let's see what Muhammad Amir can...
criticism. Oh, I liked it. Whereas Sias Midgets wanted to go in the hole a bit more. Isn't it funny? You look at you know, Balo Bati, even Amir here. A shorter stance, you guys. If you're slightly over, you want to go look searching. Isn't it funny? When you're really good at it, though, if you get it right, it's such a great one to, to, to the tail I'm talking about here. And you're saying this is not great. But uh, in terms of this weather, he's saying the rain's actually getting in his eyesight and it's disturbing him to take strike. It's just the way the, the breeze is coming and he's saying it's getting in my eyes. So he's managed to talk the humps into pulling the stumps out and getting the covers on. All that experience from Boom Boom Afridi.